Hello guys, so recently I created this water shader on a request from my Patreon member. And after posting this on Twitter, its tutorial is also heavily requested, and you can also download the free project file from my Patreon page. So, without further delay let's start the video. I am using a sphere for this shader. First, we need to get some smear lines for stylize water flow effect, and I am using noise texture for that. By using hashtag frame driver I can animate the texture automatically. I am creating a group of it so it can be copied easily for coloring. Now we need some water sparkles and Voronoi texture can create it easily and I am going to multiply it with noise texture so I can get some more random scatter of sparkles. And by using the same driver we can also animate the flow of sparkles. Just like before I am going to group it as well. Now we need some corners masked out, so I am using a gradient texture for that. Now let's mix the texture coordinates with noise texture for distortion, and group it as well. Now I need some wave lines so I can mask the sparkling reflection.
Now we need a group of sparkle so we can mask it with wave texture we just created. I am grouping this and adding location to group input and duplicating it two times. And changing location in group instances so we can add them together. Now I am masking these sparkles with wave texture. I am also multiplying gradient texture on it so I can subtract the corners. I am adding smear lines to this. And I also adding the sparkles in this. Now I am adding gradient texture on it. We have a working alpha now. Let's create some dynamic reflection and we're going to use the glossy shader for that. With noise texture and bump we can get some sparkles from actual light source. Now with geometry and vector math node we can manipulate the direction of reflection. Now time for creating the water base shader. But before that we need to change the blend mode to alpha blend and turn on screen space refractions. Now duplicate the glass shader and play with IOR a little. And I am going to use the noise texture as a mask between these glass shades.
It's time to use mix shader and put the alpha in factor and shader in shader output. Now we can start the coloring process. First, I am using an environment texture with Blender's Forest HDRI. I am using a hue saturation node to control the brightness of HDRI. Now we are going to use the groups we used in alpha to color our shader. I am increasing the brightness of sparkles so it will glow. And I am using gradient as mask to fill the base color. and using smear lines and factor output so we can use the HDRI to fill the color. I am adding the sparkles on it as well. I am increasing the brightness of sparkles, and because of that the mask of wave texture is not working. So, I removed it from alpha panel and directly added to sparkle group.
Now it's time to create the outline. For that I am going to use the solidify modifier with flipped normals data. And increasing the material index to 1. Add a new material and check backface culling with alpha blend and no shadows. Now we need to factor it with layer weight node. Now our water shader is done, and we can add some displacement effects on it now. I am going use a displacement modifier and an empty for that. In displacement modifier go to texture and select the wood texture. And select empty as an object to control the direction of texture. We can use the delta transform to rotate empty of world axis. Now to distribute the leaves I am going to use this texture plane which I cut in many separate objects. I am going to use the geometry nodes for that. Click new and drag the leaves collection on graph. Add distribute points on faces node, and instance on points node. Check separate children, reset children and pick instances. And add rotation to rotation. Now add a rotate instance node and uncheck local space. Now change the mod to Poisson Disk to control the minimum distance between objects. So, we are done with the water shader. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching.